Cook and Cassis Rifle TV in association with Mecklen's Gym Marbella. We're in Manchester here today for the high stakes bill. With me, I've got the new British welterweight champion, Sam Eggington. Just keeps on rolling with you, doesn't it, Mr. Yes, Eggington? Um, let's talk about the fight first of all. Obviously, went to the judges' scorecards after a cut. Must have been sunk in the air because everyone's getting Everyone, cut tonight. Yeah. So let's hope that was the last one. But um, how did you feel the fight was going leading into that? Comfortable, round? I mean. I thought, uh, apart from the first round, I thought I lost first. But apart from that, I thought I won every round. Um, and as, I, as it got later, I thought I was winning more comfortable. I weren't doing as much, but nor was he. Mm. Mm. You bit disappointed, obviously, it wasn't as conclusive yeah, as yeah, I a mean, points win or, you know, you I'd like, I'd like to have stopped him myself or obviously gone through to the 12th and, and won my first 12 round fight, like, at over the 12 round distance. But either way, mate, it, it was. Um, Relatively easy work, and we got the win. You seem to be put obstacles in front of you where some people are writing you off, and you're coming through these obstacles. So it's about how far you can go now, surely, isn't it? Yeah, I you mean, probably want to defend that a couple of times. Of maybe? course, I want to keep the British out right. <laughs> that's that's um, if any anyone can anyone can try and win the British and take it on for good, they're going to try. So that's what I'm going to try and do. Whether it's um, I'll have a defence before Christmas, hopefully. Maybe two, hopefully. And but also important to build up your rankings with the WBC as well. Yeah, I mean, I'll put, like, I don't know if you can, but you can put them all on the line anyway, can't you? I'm not sure about the rules and regulations <laughs> of the, but, the international belts, but... But if I, if I lost a 12-round fight on championship weight, you lose that anyway, don't you? Is that right? What, if you were defending a British yeah. title? I'm not too sure. No, you not get that, the Commonwealth, you would have. Oh, you would, would you? Oh, yeah. oh, the Commonwealth. Yeah. Oh, well, there you go. I mean, it doesn't matter. I mean, I'll defend the British. I'll have an um, international fight trying to raise my ranking. But we'll see what happens. Hopefully, October, though, I'll get a first defence of this. This is a belt that, obviously, every boxer before they turn professional, doesn't matter who they are, whether they're, you know, Olympic stardom yeah. or whatever it is, they always say that's the first thing they want to... Yeah, they want to win the British I'm title. assuming that's not, no different to you. you no, I mean, as soon as I win. turned over, obviously I didn't have um, many ambitions, but I always said if I, f if I could have a, have a shot at the British title, I'd pull it all in and, and try and win it. And that's what's happened tonight. So I put the work in and we won the fight quite easily. I know Barry Hearn must have said something to you after the fight. Yeah, he did come in. He was, um, <laughs> <laughs> it was, it was, his compliments were very short. Um, he told me to carry on working. Um, Keep my weight down and just stay in the gym. So, that's what I'm going to do. Barry's always had a favourite fighter. He used to be Lee Purdy. He retired, so now it's you. Yeah. And Good compliment. Exactly. He's the main man. Forget about it, yeah. He's the main <laughs> man. I can't move. Barry's on board, mate. <laughs> so. All right, well, listen, congratulations. Peg ain't here, is he? I don't know where Peg is. Where's your um, crackers? What crackers? For John, man. They're muscle food crackers. Oh, you know what? I completely forgot the, oh, you got the flapjacks. No, I forgot them. That'd be brilliant as well, watching John do that. I'm sure we'll have another opportunity to do that. Yeah, yeah. Time it. Think of a challenge for John Pegg. Yeah. All right, well, listen, Sam, congratulations on capturing the British title tonight. And uh, hopefully we'll catch up with you soon. So go and have a little bit of a rest and straight back on it, as Barry yeah, would say. Yeah, exactly. All right. Cheers. Thank you very much. Thanks, Cheers, mate.